There's the house foundation. Mark the builder and his helper are putting the plate down. House is on its way and it's going to be set on the foundation tomorrow. This is December 9th, I believe, something like that. That's the water trench there. The backhoe just dug the water trench. And hopefully the plumber's going to put his pipe in. Get all that taken care of, hopefully, before we have a deep freeze. It's been very stressful watching things come, getting done and the weather closing in on us, but it seems to be getting done. That's Egan's house over in, behind that white truck. The white truck is marked the builder's truck. That mini mountain out there is our septic system. Would have liked to have it somewhere else, but that's where it had to go. Don't have much choice with the environmental people today. They seem to call all the shots. I'm standing by the upper corner of our property now. Back, which will be the back of the house. This is the plumber or electrician. Somebody's putting in the well, putting in the pump for the well. And that's the trench that I saw from the road. And Mark and his helper, the builder, are getting the foundation ready. The house should be here shortly. Hope to get some pictures of it as it pulls in. That's Cato, another furriner, taking the money out of the mouths of Americans. Beautiful view from up here. By tomorrow night, I hope I can't see that mountain from here. I hope the house is going to be in the way. First part of the house just pulled up. I don't know what the guy's doing. He's taking a look to see if it's strapped down, I guess, before he makes a swing in the driveway. Look like a very big house right now. Johnny be awful unhappy, but it'll grow, I guess. This is the first section of the house. The guy's trying to back it in the driveway right now. Jockeying it around to get the right angle. Angle of attack, and he's pulling in, hoping it doesn't end up in a ditch. Well, one half is on the site. just pulled up and right there I guess he's gonna have to figure out how to get in too he'll probably come in the same way are on the site. I guess tomorrow they'll have to move around with the bulldozer to get by the crane. These guys, these clowns didn't even leave room for the crane to get in. It's probably going to be another struggle tomorrow. But I guess I'm not supposed to worry about things like that. That's what Joan keeps telling me. Right, Joni? Again. 
getting the house all set to pick up with the crane. Should be doing that shortly. First section of the house went on while I was on my break. Went down to see Joy and Mark and they picked up the first section and set on the foundation which they're not quite done doing yet. Somehow it's sitting there kind of cockeyed. Maybe they just pick it up on that angle to get it even with the foundation and then set it. Hopefully. They'll be picking the roof up into position after they get the main house set on the foundation. They're still setting it back section here, trying to get the last corner in the back lined up. They haven't really set it down completely yet. The man is giving it directions to the crane. It's like they're getting ready to set it down. They must have anchored this corner so it won't move. Mark wondering what's happening over here. I heard some comment about the foundation. They have a steel beam here that goes underneath the two halves of the house. The beam looks so flimsy it looks like the house is going to hold the beam instead of the beam holding the house. Well, I guess everything works out all right in the end when you put all the pieces together. Everybody's moving, but I don't know what anybody's doing. Well, the first section is set. I don't know what this guy's doing. I think he's the one that was nailing it down to the sill. Yeah, he's still nailing. I think their next operation is to hook on to the roof, pull the roof up into position and prop it before they set the second half. Well, they're setting the rigging now to pick the roof. Things are moving along pretty nice. Like a 
big jigsaw puzzle to put all the pieces in their proper place.
lag bolting all the rafters to the house so that the roof doesn't blow away on us. The roof is in three sections. The bottom section gets folded down and the top section is folded up and then it would be a complete half a roof. This is still the rear of the house. See some temporary props now on the middle section of the roof. While I was in the back watching, I guess they just put those props in there. Looks like they're just about ready for the crane to let it hang. About picking up the second section. I'm ready to pick the last section here, or the front section. We're all rigged up. They'll be picking it up momentarily. That pneumatic hammer you hear is the guy underneath. These things, I guess, come bolted right down solid onto the trailer. While they're doing that, back section of the house, flop down the lower section of the roof. Now he's got to put a couple of courses of shingles where the fold was. Oh, I just heard a big bump. Yeah, I hear a guy saying it got hung up on the brackets. I don't like the sounds I'm hearing. I probably shouldn't even be here today.
still got to move down towards the garage end. keeping you amused because I don't know what else to say right now. I'm not much of a narrator. The weather's not too bad out here today. We got a good break. Got a little rain and sleet last night. But just a coating on the ground, just enough to make it slippery underfoot. Kind of a hazy, sunshiny day today which gives them a chance to do all they have to do to get the house closed up. And then we're supposed to have more rain and snow tonight, so thank God, thank you Lord for giving us this good weather. Seems to be stuck up in the air. You know, maybe I can down to the other end now. Still a guy working on the back roof here, filling in the shingles at the fold like I mentioned before. One man operation back here. Everybody seems to have their own little job to do. And I guess that way it goes along smoothly. On the garage end now, another guy has a tug it pulling the two sections together. I guess the crane set it down a little bit while I was walking around. I heard him say it has to go down towards the other end, a quarter of an inch. Sounds good to me if they're working in that tolerance, putting these two big sections together. Put them up inside 
before they fold up the two sections of the roof, the two upper sections of the roof. Of course, that's my guess. I have never seen this done. Let's zoom in on it and see if we can talk to these people a little bit. Hey, guys. Oh, you're over there. Okay. There you are. It's so bright out here today, it's just hard to see through this view of what I'm looking at. It's kind of shaky. I hope you're not all getting sick watching this. The house looks black as I'm looking at it. Oh, I guess it's just, a, I see now there's a truck and the crane in front of it as I take my face away from the movie camera here or the video camcorder. disappeared in the house and I see there's some on the trail yet so he must have a bundle for one end of the house and a bundle for the other end of the house upstairs it's going to have windows in it. See they're swinging that up into place right now. And I don't think I'm going to get much more in the way of pictures here because my battery sign is flashing on me. Well, they've got most of the panels in place on this cable. I think there's a crew working on the other end because I see something sticking up down there. Very shortly they should be able to they should be ready to raise the rest of the roof. Imagine they put the last piece up in the gable here and probably lay the roof on top of it. They're rigging up now to set the to close up the roof. Mark tells me this guy's gonna ride the panel up, so we'll just watch and see how it's done. lunch for everybody now Mark the tree's gonna go up on the roof. Tree's going up on the roof? Yeah you don't you're not that old huh? No. You don't know about when the building tops out they put a tree on the roof and the last second. Today is Sunday December 18th it's around 1.30. I'm taking shots of your garage like I said I was gonna as you can see, they're in the process of building this thing. Big old truck in the way, though.
Hi, Grandma. Hi, Grandma. Hi, Papa. Hi, Papa. We're at your house. Okay. We're at their house, right? Yep. Stay away from this wire. You see this wire here? Stay away from that.